Welcome back. The Lobos finished strong as regular season and tournament champions. Now it's on to the NCAA tournament next week. This afternoon in front of a sold out crowd of 18,000 plus, the Lobos sharpshooting was on key. In the first half, with the Lobos trailing, it's Hugh Greenwood knocking down back-to-back three-pointers, giving the Lobos the lead. New Mexico goes into the break with a 34-32 lead. Second half, UNLV knots it up at 44, but that's the last time they would tie the game. Tony Snell caps off a sensational tournament run, scoring the Lobos' final 13 of 17 points. He hit five three-pointers in the win. Meanwhile, check this out. Yeah, Kendall Williams putting the exclamation point on the win. Why not? Lobos win 63 56. So here's a look at the Lobos resume. Lobos finish one win shy of 30. Their strength of schedule ranks as number two. They have 10 top 50 wins and a 19 and 5 record against the top 100. New Mexico went a perfect 4 0 this season against top 25 teams. And on neutral sites this year, they went 6 0. Van Tate is in Las Vegas with reaction on the Lobos big win. A breakout game for Tony Snell is just another storyline for the 15th ranked Lobos who have made cutting down nets and winning championships a habit. This is the look. Uh, fans love this look. So we're just trying to do what the fans like. A red blazer at home, net around the neck, net around the neck uh, on the road. Uh, it's exciting every time. It just feels like a whole new experience, even though we did win it last year, to be able to come out with such a tough conference and win not just a regular season, but then to back it up in the tournament. It's an amazing experience. It's definitely a great feeling. You know, all the hard work we did in the summer is definitely paying off today, so that's, that's a good feeling. Uh, it's a great experience right here. We won a big game, came in a good atmosphere, and won a big-time game. Hey, we're a selfish group. We don't like to share. So we didn't share a championship this whole season, so, you know, we feel good. You know, credit to our guys, we stuck with it, being picked fourth or fifth in the conference at the beginning of the year, having that chip on our shoulder, it's a credit to these guys and credit to the fans for making this feel like a home game for us. You know, when you've won 29 and um, you've won back-to-back -back championships um, in two years, um, I hope our guys do have a little swag and I hope our coaches have a little swag. With the victory, the 29-5 and five Lobos have claimed an automatic bid to the NCAA tournament. They will return home tomorrow and face a national television audience as they find out who they will play next. To have CBS come in and do the selection show and select us as one of their teams in the pit, that's extremely exciting. So we're looking to fill that pit tomorrow and, and have, a, have a celebration and then find out who we're playing in season four here. The Selection Sunday show is right here on KRQE. We'll have our own local version following the national broadcast. Van Tate, KRQE News 13 Sports, Las Vegas. All right.